The Coagsense PT-INR monitoring system, with its direct clot detection technology, offers lab quality results from the convenience of your own home. This video provides a brief overview of how to perform a PT-INR self-test. Please be sure to read your entire user manual carefully before you use your system. Lay out the required testing supplies in the order which they will be used. Note that home testing service providers typically do not provide alcohol wipes, in which case you should wash your hands with soap and water and dry them thoroughly before testing. If an alcohol wipe is used, the finger must be completely dry as residual alcohol will affect the results. Press and hold the power button on the right side of the meter to turn the meter on. When the system finishes booting up, the main menu will be displayed. Press the test button. Confirm that the patient strip lot number displayed matches the lot number on the test strip pouch. If the number does not match or the field on the meter is blank, then touch the NFC chip located on your test strip packaging to the NFC target rings on the meter case. If the NFC chip is not available, then manually enter the lot and barcode numbers from the patient test strip. Then press the Continue button. The display will now display the message to please insert a strip. Holding the meter steady with one hand, gently insert the test strip in a smooth fashion all the way to the back of the meter. If you receive an error on inserting the test strip, simply remove the strip and reinsert it in a smooth fashion. Do not discard the test strip. While the test strip is warming, insert the black plastic plunger into the end of the glass tube with the red strip, being careful to avoid hitting the white plug. Your test strips may include transfer tubes with the plunger preloaded into the glass tube. Hold your hand below your heart and massage the middle finger from the palm of your hand towards the last joint of the finger. After Apply Sample is displayed on the meter, Press down hard on the finger with your lancet and lance your finger according to the instructions provided by your lancet manufacturer. 21 gauge lancets are required for proper blood flow. Do not use smaller diabetes lancets. Apply pressure above the joint and squeeze the finger from the side using your thumb and index finger from your other hand. Keep squeezing the finger until you produce a pea-sized bead of blood. Holding the transfer tube horizontally, Touch the tip to the bead of blood and let capillary action fill until blood flow stops at the white plug. Squeeze the finger to generate additional blood if required to completely fill to the white plug. Insert the transfer tube tip into the sample application well of the test strip and touch the tip down at the flashing green light in front of the spinning wheel. Depress the black plunger completely to dispense the blood. You must apply the blood to the test strip within 15 seconds of lancing your finger. The light should go out and the meter should display, Testing, please wait. The testing time is your actual clotting time. When testing is complete, the meter beeps once and the results, INR and prothrombin time, appear on the screen. Remove the test strip and properly dispose of it along with the sample transfer tube and lancet. Turn off the meter by pressing and holding the power button. The test result is recorded in memory and it can be found on the main menu using the results button. If you encounter any error or require personal support, please call COAGSense Technical Support at 866-903-0890.